Get over yourself, dude. Nah. This game's about pigeons. Pigeon. Alright. Here we are. Game. Let's do this. New game. Please enter your name. Hioko. Frostin. They don't let me add the G. Oh uh, no, why? Is G not a letter in this game? <laughs> I just don't have enough room. I'm Frostin. I got a little bit of a oh, southern God. twang. <laughs> Frosted G. <laughs> yes, that's fine. Display human portraits. Uh, yeah. Display human. I guess. Yeah. Sure. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. I should probably say this school is known for one thing in particular. This school is Japan's. No, the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. Oh boy. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports, all come to St. Pigeon Nations. The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. Already. I'm often asked why I choose to come here, despite not being a bird. It's a long story. Not every day I see you rushing along like this. <laughs> Yuta! Usually, you'd have been ready for an hour by now, Frosten. Overslept? This rock dove is named Kawara. Yota, something like that. That's the pronunciation somehow, I don't know. We've been friends since he was barely hatched! Look at him! He can be a little mischie mischievous, but he's responsible and kind. Breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. Living as a hunter-gatherer sounds tough. I'd be happy to make you breakfast, you know. I might take you up on that offer when starvation looms. Thanks, Yuta. I'm just gonna call him R. Just like my last name is G. Oh! The bell already? Come on. We need to hurry to class. Jeepers! <laughs> no good being late on the first day. And so R pulled me along into the school. Today is the start of a new semester. I wonder what lies in store. It was all I could do to adjust to the atmosphere last year. Better make up for all that lost fun. It's my first term. The most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon, by the pigeon, and for the pigeon. I think we're in 2-3. R and I are in the same class again. Old faces, new faces. A strange thrill fills my heart as I look around at the assembled birds. I hope we all get along. Here's to the formation of many happy memories. Oh! The teacher's here! Good morning, everybody. Er... I'm Nanaki Kazuaki. 
I seem to be your teacher this year. I specialize in math and physics, and also some other things. Sir, wake up! It's homeroom! He sleeps with his eyes open. There's my teacher. Here he is. This quail is Nanaki Kazuaki. He's famously sapphiric math professor. I'd heard the rumors, but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep just like that. Apparently he's well known as a mathematician. Just goes to show, great minds come in all forms. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. Isn't it a little warm in here? Which reminds me, we have a transfer student. Please introduce yourself, Shirogane. What is the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think I'm here because I wish to be. Oh, well, I guess that's that. Hey, 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 that's no good. But he doesn't want to introduce himself. But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all turn into... Kolaks and Dezenters. Kolaks? Well, when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shiragane? Shiragane Lebel Sakuya. Nice name. Uh huh. It seems this fan tell is Shiragane Sakuya. His feathers would make an any birdie proud. He's pretty stuck up, but then transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. Sakuya sits down, glaring daggers at Ryotu and me. I think this little bird is telling me there's gonna be trouble down the line. Lunch already! Today is slipping by so quickly. That reminds me, I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. Where is everyone? Aside the, from the receptionist, there's hardly any birdie here. Huh? Is someone looking at me? Probably just my imagination. Or not. A morning dove stands in a dark corner, staring in my direction. Morning doves aren't very common in Japan, but apparently they're everywhere in America. Um, did you want something from me? He looked away. Not really. I'm pretty sure it was him who I felt looking at me. There's no one else here. Are you sure? Yes. I don't want anything with you. It's the things you're carrying that I'm interested in. He glances at the desk, as to say, hurry up and return them already. Oh, sorry. <laughs> they were a little too dense and I never finished them. Were you waiting for them all summer? He silently returns his gaze to his book. Maybe he's in a bad mood. I'm G. Frosten, a sophomore. What about you? You're... Nageki. Fujishiro Nageki. Freshman. He reminds me of my boy Bedlam. Let me invite him to, to watch the stream real quick. Here we go. Boom. Watch the stream. Alright. Fujishiro Nageki, huh? Morning doves are pretty rare in Japan. Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kind of sad. Leave me alone. He's reading his book again. Okay, sorry to bother you. I keep meeting depressing people today. Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait, isn't that... You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Come on, Sukuya. 
What kind of thing is that to say to your own brother, after all these years? My brother? You must be joking. You've never once been a brother to me. Please, don't try to talk to me again. I've no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Oh, oh shit, my blood! Hey, wait a... I guess even if we're in the same school now that what's done is done. I hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just overheard something juicy. The ever popular trendsetter and ladies man, Sakazaki Yuya, is Sakuya's brother. I wonder what the story behind that is. Hey. You heard that whole thing, right? Are you a friend of Sakuya's? I... I'm sorry. I didn't mean to listen in on you. Haha. <laughs> no sweat. I try to say sexy and suave in front of you, all you little ladies, but that there wasn't too cool. <laughs> this fan tell pigeon is Sakazaki Yuya, an upperclassman. I've never talked to him before, but he's famous, or infamous, throughout the school. Everybody knows of him. You're frosting, right? How did you know? I know every birdie here. Besides, you're the only human. A single poppy in a field of rye. Did you say you were a friend of Sakuya's? Not exactly. We had a rather ballistic introduction this morning. We're in the same class, that's all. I'd never have thought that stuck-up aristocrat wannabe was your brother. Aristocrat wannabe. He is an aristocrat, actually. The genuine article, in the flesh. He is? He's a bit of a pain, so good luck, mon ami. Adieu. He really is a noble bird. I've never heard anything like that about you, though. Probably a twisty business. That's all for today. Stay safe, everyone. Yay! Huh? Sir, where's Yuta? He said he was going to the infirmary. Maybe you should go and see if he's still here. Now that I think about it, Ryuta always did have a weak stomach. I should go to the infirmary just to make sure he's okay. Excuse me. No birdies here? There's no one sleeping behind the curtains, and the doctor isn't here either. My hunter-gatherer instincts feel no presence. There's no birdie here. Ryuta? No reply. The infirmary is empty. Weird. Did he go home already? I feel a little nervous poking around the empty room. Now that I think of it, I haven't been in here much before. Unlike Ryuta, I'm perfectly healthy. Whoa, they've got all kinds of drugs in here. Ethiopar, Trife, Lysio Benzene. What do these even do? Care to find out? <laughs> D -d 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 Doctor? I'll feed you all sorts of things if you want, hmm? No, thank you! This partridge is Iwamini Shu, the school doctor. He's rather creepy in person, has a bad reputation among the student body. Iwamine, yeah, alright, there we go. <laughs> Kind of butchered that one. Every birdie knows that even just talking to him can bring you down with aspergillus, cynicosis, or even worse things. And I never even heard him come to the door. Ninja Doctor? You don't look like you have a good reason to be in here. Did you need something? 
Um, I heard Yuta Kawara from 2-3 was supposed to be here. Him! He's already gone. Oh. Why didn't he come find me before going home? Sorry to bother you. I'll be going now. Ah. Finally out of that den of evil. The Yutsa's already gone home. What do I do now? Oh. I never got around to joining a club last year. Maybe I'll go take a look at some of my options. I think there are clubs for baseball, soccer, track, kendo, migration, bird watching. Wasn't there another one? Anyway, I'll start with the track team. I ran in middle school, and it's always fun watching the birds hop around. I think their club room is on the ground floor, off to the side. A white dove is having a t tantrum outside. Cuckoo! This is no pudding for a man. Coo! Okasan rejects it. It is a lie, a vicious false fiction. He's dancing around on a squished pudding. Hey, that's not very nice to the pudding. Okosan. This is Okosan. He doesn't really look it, but supposedly he's a fantail pigeon. I think. Either way, he's hyper, and also doesn't have a human representation. Coo! Okasan has suffered a, de a deception most vile, a wretched betrayal. Betrayal? Coo! Okasan instructed that the pudding be provided for new members. Coo! But this is no pudding. Ousted, scorned, betrayed, dragged into the street, and shot by those he trusted most. It's squished and filthy, but the thing under his feet looks like normal store-bought pudding. What's wrong with it? Cuckoo! Spare the jests, young lady. Okasan used wing attack. It's super effective. Coo! They're rue the day they crossed Okosan. He'll have them flayed, hanged, shot at dawn, he will. Coo! Okosan must now train to achieve true pudding. Farewell. And he's gone. He's a good runner, but what does pudding have to do with the track team? And so ended the first day of my second semester at St. Pigeon Nations. Er, I think we want to choose the class council today. As you all know, this school doesn't require you to join any club. If you want to, you can, but if you don't, then you're free to go home after school. Coo! Okasan has time only for the track team. That's good. What about you, Shirogane? A foolish question. I already hold a position here. Oh, that's right. You became student president when you were admitted. Nepotism ho! Don't we get to vote? Just coming to school is enough for me. You have to take care of your mother on your own and all. Hmm. I wonder what I should do. Join the... Alright. <clears throat> Alright, boys and girls. So we have three options here. We can join the student council, the track team, or the library staff. Go ahead and uh, let me know in chat, or Elena, you can let me know on Mumble. I'm watching chat. I'm just waiting to see what people say. <clears throat> Joseph gives me a I do like that guy on the track team. Okay. Okasan is uh is interesting, yeah.
if we uh if we do track team we probably have to deal with him quite a bit cool yeah uh student council will have to deal with the stuck up bird and probably his brother and the library staff we might end up with that depressed freshman kid so uh I don't know. I enjoyed speaking for Okosan. He was he was enjoyable. I think we're gonna go with uh I think we're gonna go with track team. No, no, you're too late. We're going with track team. Track team it is. That's everyone, isn't it? Have fun! Oh man, here comes the stats. That was- that was just the introduction, everyone. Ahem! <clears throat> Today is an elective day. What should I do? Attend... Oh no... Oh, here we go. Music class? I wonder what these stats mean. W I S V I T G A C H A uh Vitality I'm guessing, so my health probably wisdom charisma. Okay, here we go. I wanna say music class, but if we're in track, we need to do gym. We need to get we need to get strong. I'm gonna go with gym. No, I'm gonna go with Jim. I think we have to. I had to sit out the wing training, but it was fun anyway. Maybe someday I'll be able to fly too. Oh, I didn't even think about that! We're at a school for birds! What a dumb! Ugh. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, I leveled up though. My vitality increased by five. Okay. I'm guessing VIT means vitality. I need to go sign up for track. I want to join the team, but I wonder if Okosan's having a fit again. I'll find out when I get there. Coo! A frostin appears. Is this a challenge then? Choose your weapon, ma'am, and draw! A fit he is having, though not overputting. Not really. I want to join the team. Do you know where the captain is? Koo! He stands before you. Okosan is the captain, and a faster bird the world has never known. I never knew. Oh, well, here, my forms. Thank you. Koo! A dove never refuses a challenge. Commence the entrance examination. There's an exam? Koo! Of course. Track isn't daisy chain making, Missy. Coo! Okasan will be your opponent in the noble combat. Sprint or long distance. Um. I don't know. I I think I'm more of a sprinter than a long distance runner. Coo! Humph! <laughs> a sprint barely lasts long enough to get started. How dull! Coo coo! On your mark, get set, go! How is he so fast? He can't even fly this fast. Pant, pant. Coo! You're still weak, but you've got potential. Welcome to the team. Thanks? Coo! That's all, folks. And so I joined the track team. Who knew doves could run like that? I can just imagine them waddling across the track real quick. Ah, uh, sitting at home is so relaxing. Oh, tomorrow's the class hike. Hold up though, we're sitting at home right now? I'm a human, right? So I'm in a, I'm in a cave? Okay. Should I prepare anything? We won't be going far, so I don't have to. Well, health first. 
I think I'll have some udon and go to sleep. Today is the hike. We've stopped for a break on a hillside. Who should I talk to? Talk to... Alright. So, this is my best friend. Uh, I forget which one this is. That's my track team member guy, and I think that's the uptight bird. So, do we do we make friends with our track team guy? Do we talk to our best friend? All right. Well, that's the first word, the first one I saw in chat. So let's talk to them. What is it, G? Break is no real. Oh, it's our teacher? Yeah, I think that's our teacher. Um, I wanted to talk to you, sir. Your friends are all here. Why not talk with them? Do you want do you not want to talk to me? No, that's not what I meant. You're a funny girl, G. Wait, no, I haven't said anything yet. So I took a nap with Mr. Naki. <laughs> I wonder if he has some sort of illness. I hope he's okay. Today's an elective day. What should I do? Attend. Alright, so Jim, we have a pretty big number here. I don't know... I don't know what's going to go on with that. Maybe we get in fights or something? Bird fights? Uh, but I doubt it. So we're going to go ahead and leave that there. Math seems to be our lowest skill here, so we're going to go ahead and go with math. I'm not getting this at all. What's new? Hmm. Maybe you should review the basics a little more, G. Yes, sir. <laughs> Crossed and leveled up. Wisdom increased by five. So it was wisdom. Boom, baby. Er, I imagine you're all well aware, but the sports festival is right around the corner. Please think about what you'll do. Sports festival season already? If it were in the fall, it would conflict with the cultural festival, so it's always been in May. What are you going to do? I haven't decided, but probably the three-legged race. Some birdie has to. Coo! Oko-san will handle the marathon. Indeed he will. You do have a lot of stamina, Oko-san. What about you? You can't possibly be expecting me to run in some rate. It is a sports festival. Is there an event that doesn't involve running? How about being a cheerleader? The general, in other words. Very well. Leave it to me. Um, I don't think that's... Also, the first aid team is always shorthanded, so I'm sure they could use help if any birdie can't, still can't decide. That's all for today. Ryotsu's doing the three-legged race, Soko-san's running the marathon, and Sakuya's the cheerleader. Sakuya might be running the first aid tent. What should I do? I'll have to think about it. Today's the sports festival. I never did make up my mind. What should I do? Go to the... Alright, here we go. Three-legged race, marathon, cheerleaders, first aid tent, or library. So we already know where everyone is as far as our friends and other birds are. And then there's also the library. 
Now, if this were Halo 1, I wouldn't go to the library. But, you know, that's not what this is. I want to participate in the festival, alright? So, I don't know if I want to go to the library. Cheerleaders? We can go... Okay, we can go with the stuck-up bird. Uh... Okay, cheerleaders it is. There's something of a crowd around our cheerleaders. I, si I see Sakuya and a brass band? That's overdoing it. I think I saw something similar during the changing of the guard at Buckingham Palace. You're here! You're not cutting any corners, I see. Naturally not. Only the best from LaBelle. Horn. Sir! Preparations are complete, sir. Your order, sir. Very well. Begin! And so the band began to play. Where did he get these people? They all look like professionals. Shouldn't cheerleaders be students? You! Join in! Um, okay. I seem to be in charge of the symbols. One wrong slip, and I'll be the laughing stock of the playground. Yikes! Sakuya's conducting is awfully flashy. Is this the LaBelle style? And there's the end of the music. Whoops. The first barrier for all students to make it this far. The midterm exam. We're getting them back today. Ah, I don't think I did too well. Gee! Yes! Hmm, I don't think you did too badly. Y yes Not to... No, sorry. You did badly. Thanks a lot, teacher. <laughs> no. Try harder next time, okay? I disappointed Mr. Nanaki. I'll have to study more from now on. Okay. I had six wisdom. I, I don't know what to say about that. With the festival and the midterm over, there's nothing to look forward to but summer heat. Doves smell kind of funny when it gets humid like this. Huh? There's a bunch of birds in front of the staff room. What are they doing? Oh, there's Yuya. I think that's how you say it. Yuya? Yuya? Something like that. What's going on? Salutations, Frosten. Brian won his seventh Pulitzer. Damn, Brian. He gestures at a news clipping on the staff room pin board. It says... Brian, the first intelligent pigeon, crowned again. Brian? Don't tell me you don't know who he is. I think I've heard the name, but... He's the world's most famous blogger. He began when birds were barely intelligent. He's a very skilled and insightful writer. He was the one who suggested that the Dove Olympics be called the Pidge Olympics. Real good. It's real. He was the first one who suggested that the Dove Olympics be called the Pidge Olympics. He's extremely influential. The name was adopted right away. Why don't you look him up right now, Monami? Try googling Brian Pigeon. Okay. Okay. Uh oh. Lunch is nearly over. I'll do frosting. Hmm. Today is a good day. I feel like I'm shining. I wonder what I should do during break. Go to the. Okay. So, I don't think we have any money. 
but I'm real interested to see where we might get what we might get at the store. If we go on over to the infirmary, we get Dr. Pigeon again. And cafeteria is a whole new world. So But we've already seen the doctor. <laughs> no, we already know the doctor's there. I want to know what's at the store in the cafeteria. You guys get to choose between store and cafeteria. I, I do not want to go to the, the infirmary again. Choose store or cafeteria. Okay. But let's think about it. Bird food is worms. Alright? So it's like. Alright, we're gonna go to the cafeteria, I guess. Let's do it. I think I'll leave the cafeteria today. I guess it is lunch after all. Excuse me, one half dead fried rice, please. Yum, my favorite. So they didn't have bird food. Coo! No, this is wrong. A fake, a vicious lie. A fam familiar voice indeed. Coo! This is not pudding. I know, you said, so come on, let's eat outside. We can't horse around in here. What's going on? Not that I can't tell by looking. San saw the pudding over here and went nuts. I stopped him from going on a rampage, but... Ow! Cut it out, Ogasan! Coo! Release me at once! My rage voltage is rising! Help me, Frostin. Um... Leave it to me. Let him go. I think we're gonna have to interrupt this bird, everyone. Leave it to me. My hunter gatherer blood boils. Arr! <laughs> Coo! No! The beast queen shows her true colors. Pull out! Pull out! Okasan rushes from the cafeteria like a rabbit from a catapult. Ah, safe at last. Thanks, Frostin. Yeah, no prob. No problem. All I did was shout at him, anyway. Apparently that was enough. Now we can all eat lunch without fear of disaster. Today's an elective day. What should I do? Attend. Okay, so... I don't know where this extra came from I, I really don't even know what that means I'm guessing charisma but I don't I don't know where these extra stats came from here it's either from the festival or from doing whatever we just did in the cafeteria but this is still the lowest so I think we're gonna go with some more math class so we don't fail our next midterm I guess final I always find myself wondering what the math we learn is good for. Coo. And now we can draw a line perpendicular to the... Is this math class or nap time? I leveled up. Wisdom increased by five. Today is Tanabata. There's probably a bamboo tree in the plaza this year, too. I think I'll go make a wish.
Wow. There are, there are lots here already. Any birdie I know? May mother stay healthy this year. And may my stomach get better. Impossible. I don't know what that middle one is. Pas Francois. Morning conference on 10th. Leave 30 minutes early. Buy another alarm clock. May I wake up on time? Wednesday is garbage day, remember. What should I wish for? Conquer the world by horse? Rule the world from the shadows? Become a famous artist. Two of these don't seem to fit the whole like feeling of this this game right now. This visual novel. Um I really, I really don't know how to feel about this, but uh, the popular vote right now is rule the world from the shadows. So let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> I wish to take the reins of power through clever schemes and rule the world from the shadows. Oh, hello. Is that Yuji? Mr. Nanaki. You should be careful out this late. It can be dangerous for a girl, you know. I was about to head home. Would you like to walk me to walk you to your place? Um This is my teacher, right? Yeah, this is my teacher. So it's like I don't know how I feel about that. I guess he can walk us home. Thanks, Teach. Yes, please. Alright. Mr. Nanaki demonstrated some extreme sleeping on the way home, but we arrived eventually. Home sweet home. My cave in a spoon. Your house is very... rustic, G. I like it this way. It's wonderful to have a place to come back to, isn't it? Wonderful indeed. He looks a little sad. Um, sir? See you tomorrow. Don't forget your homework. And so he left. A somewhat hollow sounding farewell echoing behind him. Or was it just my imagination? <laughs> Today's an elective day. What should I do? Alright. <clears throat> Big wisdom. Up to 21 there. Uh, so we're gonna try music class for the first time. Let's see. I've been placed in charge of the timpani today. That's not how... Okay. <clears throat> Last time it was the gong. What am I supposed to be? The musical gorilla? Frost and leveled up. Charisma increased by five. Music equal charisma. Okay. I'm just checking out their, uh, their staffs over here. We get our finals back today. I'm not sure I did too well. Gee! Sir? Well done. You've gotten even better. Keep up the good work. Yes, sir. Success! Alright, so I had enough wisdom this time. Today's the last day. It's been a semester already. 
Sometimes it seemed long and sometimes it seemed short, but either way, it's summer now. I should help clean up the club. Room and check the summer before I go home. The club room. It's one word, okay. To the track club! Munch, munch, munch. Oko-san looks excited. Not angry for once, but still. This is... Ah! What are you doing? The floor is covered in beans! Munch, munch. They're good! Looks like he's been stockpiling his nutritional balance supplements and is eating them all at once. He certainly seems happy about it. What should I do? Scold him? Join in! Join in it is! These look pretty good! Munch, munch, yum! And so we devoured two months worth of dietary supplements in one day. <laughs> it's easy to fall out of practice and get fat and lazy during the summer vacation. A hunter-gatherer's body is her way of life, so maybe I'll go running today. Okay? So it seems... That the city is in ruins. Okay. Ah, that was a good run. A true running girl's way to start vacation. I wonder how far I ran. I always lose track of where I'm going once the runner high kicks in. Where am I? I must have wandered out of my usual stomping ground at some point. Which way did I come from? Don't fail me now. Fail with the combing instinct. The sun setting. I'd rather not sleep outside. Hey, you. Huh? I don't know you. Where'd you come from? A sparrow stands next to me, squinting up at my face. Her wing is resting on a motor scooter. It looks a little bit vintage. How cute! Is this gonna be a fight? I feel a strange pressure. I can't tell right away that the sparrow isn't just anybody. Um, I'm from St. Pigeonations. I was out for a run and got lost. You ran all the way from there? You must be good. It's about a two hour drive from here. What? I guess that's why my legs hurt. Ah, I wonder if I'll be able to run home again. Hmm. I like the cut of your jib. Anyone that determined deserves a ride home. Come on. The intimidating sparrow gestures at her scooter. It's a little small, but we should both fit, I think. Thank you. Um, may I ask your name? Koshiba is yummy. I sell uh, takoyaki. Call me Azami. Then thank you, Azami. Alright, that music. It felt like a fight was coming, but I guess not. You're a very cautious driver. Carve it into your soul, kid. One accident is all it would take, and that would be the end of both of our lives. Maybe it may seem strange to a young girl like you, but once you've lost someone, you'll understand. There's a far off look in her eyes. I'm sure you know what you're talking about, but at this rate, I might get home faster by walking. Do you think we'll get there by dawn? Carve it into your soul. The speed limit for scooters is 30 kilometers per hour. We're not even going that fast. Following traffic laws is part of my credo. Credo. Isn't riding tandem against the law too? That rule is for humans. 
birds are light, so one or two more doesn't stop the brakes from working. We're fine like this. But I'm not a bird. And so we put putted along at a zombie's hypercautious speed. By the time we got to my house, it was almost light out. <laughs> It's still a long time until the semester starts, and I still have a lot of homework. Maybe I should apply for a part-time job, since I have the chance. I'll... Get a job? Forget it! Yes, we're actually human. We're, like, supposed to be the only human in an all-bird school. So are we going to get a job, or are we going to forget it? Forget it. <laughs> Yo, but there's a store at school. We need money, and to get money we need a job. And I mean, we don't even know what's at the store, so... Would it even help us? It doesn't seem like we have a player character. I don't know, you guys didn't want me to go to the store, so we don't know what the money was for. We could bully other birds at school for money. Alright, forget it. We're forgetting it. Hmm. I think I'll wait until I'm in college. That way I can ki can skip lectures to go to work. Okay. Slacking off and having fun is more the high schooler thing to do. Wee. <laughs> Today is the local summer festival. I think I'll go with some birdie. Invite. Okay, who are we inviting? Best friend, uh, stuck up bird, I think, someone, track guy, teacher. Yo, we're really not help like asking our friends at anything. He's like our best friend and we're not going. But I mean, I guess we did save him from oh this guy right here. I mean, I like him. Alright, next name I see, we're gonna go. I mean, the teacher just keeps going to sleep, but let's just go with this guy. I'll invite Nageki. He needs to get out more. But I don't know his address or phone number. I'd go look in the library if the school weren't already closed. Now that I think about it, I only ho know him as the depressed freshman who's always in the library. I'd like to learn more about him, though. He'd probably never tell me anything if I asked. Ah. Uh, going out is too much trouble. I think I'll have some udon and go to bed. Thanks a lot, guys! <laughs> now, now we won't go to the summer festival. So sad. Ah, I knew I should have gotten up when I first woke up. I slept way too late. School starts today, right? I'm going to be late. Oh, hello, G. Sir, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I overslept. Overslept? Ah, my homework. I forgot to bring my homework. Aren't you getting a little bit ahead of yourself, G? Huh? What's the number on the top left-hand corner say? Oh just a little bit early. Wah. Wow. Though, since you're here, could you lend me a hand for a bit, G? Lend you a hand? I was about to start grading the freshman's exams, and I thought maybe you could help if you don't have something else. Of 
course, you have a test in September, so if you want to go and study in the library, I want to... <laughs> return to my glorious abode, study in the library, or help our teacher. I kind of feel like we should study. Maybe we'll see Nageki. We'll study. We're gonna study. The library should be open now. I think we'll go study. Um, I'm sorry, sir, but I'm not sure I'm prepared enough for my test. I'd like to go study if that's alright. Of course. Work hard, okay? There are already a number of students working in the library. Looks like mostly third years? They've probably all decided on their colleges and careers already. Will I be that frantic this time next year? I wonder. Nageki is here too, leaning against a bookshelf in the far corner. Nageki! Miss G, did you need something? Why are you over here? There are still plenty of seats open. You should sit down. I don't mind standing. You look like you mind. You don't like being near other birds, is that it? He nods. They'll just... They'll just ignore me anyway, whether or not I go near. Nayaki, are you being... Bullied. Paranoid. Well, our plan was to come and bully the kids. So... I'm gonna ask about the bullying. I don't want him to be bullied. It's no good. He falls silent. There's something wrong. I'd like to help. Um, good morning everyone. I hope you had fun over the summer. Cool. Okasan is always having fun. Yup, yup. What is this fun? Once summer's over, time starts slipping by faster than ever. Try to stay focused. Focus, sir, focus! And there we go. Second term. Uh, I don't know if I can save or not, but I think this is where I'd want to stop if I could. <clears throat> so, let's see if I can save anywhere. Okay. I think that's it for this, for today. So, thanks for watching. I'll let everyone know when I go again. It will be on this channel, not my main channel. Thanks for watching.